What's going on guys, Bengal again here, coming back at you with another episode of Ben Bones Road to the Show. This is episode two, and I've looked a lot at the comments section, asked about some difficulty changes, and whether you want to see equipment or not, and overall most people are like, use equipment, uh, so I've got some equipment on, just to kind of make them look cooler, that's like the main purpose around that, and actual brands just generally looks better. Um... You also wanted to see a lower difficulty. Well, I'm not really going to do that yet, just because I know it's going to be pretty easy against, like, the absolute worst competition in AA. But I'm setting out a Hall of Fame uh, instead of Dynamic. It was, like, up to almost Legend. And I'm also going to be changing the uh, hitting interface. Or not the interface, per se, but the camera from Strike Zone, which is what I play online. I don't run, like, offset zoom. So that y'all can see Ben Bones a little bit better behind the plate. Should be a little bit more enjoyable to watch. I've moved my camera. I've done a lot of things to uh, hopefully make you like the series a whole lot more. If you haven't already liked it. But um, we will be playing our first appearance. Making the Ben Bones double A debut against the Altoona Curve. I believe that, yeah, they are the Curve. We are the whatever Sea Wolves. And it's actually cool that there are, you know, real rosters this year. So, like, we can see actual prospects. Like, Cody Clemens was a Texas Longhorn standout. Probably the best hitter in the history of the Texas Longhorns. His numbers were insane. I don't really recognize a ton of other names other than Riley Green. But uh, here we go. The Ben Bones debut. And, of course, we're playing at Barnes Canyon. It's weird. You sometimes see these in, a, in a, um, the MLB, the show Diamond Dynasty. I don't know why... Couldn't figure out what I was trying to say there. Uh, but Ben Bones has some wheels now. Really, really fast. And he's already uh, playing under the... Uh, what is it? He's the the Anomaly? Yeah, so he's going to be really fast. He's going to be hopefully super overpowered. I know a ton of people weren't a huge fan of my, uh, my PCI. Just because it's so small. But it's what we're rocking. Hopefully you like it enough. And I got way underneath that with Ben Bones. People also said I can hold L2 to actually see where the ball is when I'm running, which is a very nice, uh, helpful tip as well. But not a good start so far, as we're getting no opportunities in the field. It looks like I'm DHing or something. But uh, playing a lot of hitting appearances, which I don't hate. But this new camera could take me a minute to get used to, I'll tell you that. A little bit underneath that. That one's drifting deep to center, and that one is off the wall. We're getting three. It's a ground rule double, so we're not. <laughs> but I'll, I'll take that. Nice little double. And I'm picked off. I don't really know how that happened. I didn't try and steal. Fantastic. I, I love that. I can't play with this camera. I might get a hit on this anyway. Nah, Ben Moses is out. I might, I might just have to go back to strike zone. I can't see the ball. <laughs> I've been making a lot of ground outs. Terrible debut for Ben Bones. Terrible. Yeah, I got a double. I can't see the ball. Can't see it. Like we uh, progressed a little bit there, which is nice. I'll see that. I don't really care about the tutorials. We're just gonna figure it out. So, down on speed, but plus to contact. Those are always good things. I'm back to strike zone. I don't want to play on offset zoom. I know there are other ones where that are a little bit further away. I'm just gonna go with what I'm used to. Why get weirded out for no reason? There we go. That one's ripped up the middle. A little bit better that time. I'm just more comfortable on this camera. I think I can and square stuff up super easily compared to uh, where we kind of have been. So, I think we got to keep it this way. Here's a 2-2. We're moving because we know there's going to be contact. And that is a, a fly ball out. So, not what we wanted. Make base running mistakes. I think that much is, uh, is obvious in this series here. Hopefully, make up for it with raking. Three, he is absolutely frightened of the Bone Meister. He absolutely does not want to get boned by Ben Bones. 3-0. Green light, you say? That one's going to be hit deep. I'm way underneath it, though. Uh, not hit deep enough. I'm okay with the green light. I just got to not miss it next time. I think that much is obvious. Yeah, Ben Bones is DHing. I feel like I ripped that one. That one's deep to center, but it's a big outfield. It's not going to get out. Not even going to be close. I got to stop missing it. I got to get on the ball. Two for seven is uh, not going to do it here in the minors. We need a quick call up. We got a rake down here. And I'm just underneath everything. Obviously pretty trigger happy at the plate. But uh, I suck right now. Some more upgrades though. 
just contact and power continue to go up, we're going to be golden. It's that uh, that cap that's extending a little bit. So we're in a pretty good spot. I'm comfortable. We just got to actually start hitting. And that would be fantastic. Still DHing, which is honestly where I'm comfortable. Riley Green's not hitting it at all. We're still in the nine hole, only hitting 250. Not ideal. Not ideal at all. But a good like two for three here. Probably have like four at bats. So maybe we'll go three for four. Couple extra base hits, and we're gonna be moved up in the lineup in no time. This is a big spot here. Top two runners on first and second, two down. I was just so prepared to take. I wasn't gonna swing at all, and then he threw me a fastball right down the middle. So I just I don't know. There's no reason to come in automatically taking. We just kind of come up ready to hit whatever. And no one, the runners didn't advance on that. Are we serious? Unreal. Here we go. Meatball, good, squared up. What am I supposed to do there? Laser beam out. Another big spot. This time runners on first and third with only one down. Big RBI spot, even if we ground out. Fielder's choice. I don't think they're going to be able to double up the fastest running back in the SEC. Of course, that is a reference to the Ben Bones Road to Glory. Check that series out if you're only here for the MLB. I just took that. Uh, really fooled by how slow that was. Give me something a little bit harder to hit. A little bit harder, just missed it. Again, just late. Pretty much squared up on that. It's interesting that that was so far foul. Here's a 3-2. I'm letting you know right now, I'm not playing a walk. Give me a pitch to hit. Fayetto grooves it. No way it's another good squared up line out. <laughs> I get an RBI with Ben Bones, I guess. I'm getting boned right now. Back-to-back -back good squared up lineouts. That's ridiculous. Good okay. A little bit underneath that, I guess. Just give me an out. As the right fielder nears the track. What am I supposed to do right now, man? <laughs> I don't even feel like I'm hitting poorly. I'm just... Not getting rewarded at all. I'm, I, that's my first terrible contact of the game. Otherwise, I'm getting super, super frustrated. We lose again. Maybe if uh, those were doubles instead of back-to-back -back lineouts, this game is a different result. I feel like this episode has been so weird. It's been so scattered with the gameplay and, and figuring out what to do, upgrades and being a DH and all that. That was a huge yikes. 0 for 3 with an RBI. I don't feel like I should have been 0 for 3, man. Like, definitely should have been some outs there, but... Um, we know about uh, hitting the batting cage. Don't really care to do that, honestly. Because I can hit. You just got to reward me. But, but hey, that's baseball. All right, I guess we'll go to the batting cage. Don't want my teammates hating me. We got our teammate, Lyle Mitchell Tree. How about get a non ridiculous last name? Rivalry. Ooh, interact with the opponent. Let's do some of that. Let's build up a rivalry with Mason McCoy. 58 overall shortstop. McCoy sent some banter ahead of the game. You don't be specific or anything. Let's go with the lightning rod. Whatever, friendo. Let your game speak for itself. Kind of hate that, but okay. McCoy informs you that you're just lighting a fire under him before the next game. Here's the thing, Mason, is you suck. And Ben Bones, they've moved up to the four spot. <laughs> ben Bones hitting cleanup for this one, hitting 182. You know what they say? All right, Ben Bones, you haven't been, hit, been hitting. Let's put you in one of the most impactful spots in the entire order. Fantastic idea by the manager of the Seawolves. Let's sh let's show him how right he is. Here we go. Rain is coming down here at Oak Street Park. Played here quite a few times in Diamond Dynasty. I don't like the rain. Call the game off. Why is it raining? Oh, that one's ripped. Good squared up. It's not a line out. That's unreal. You would have thought. All right, now we know that we can't just run no matter what on contact. I don't want a base run, but... And it's going to be strike him out, but not throw him out. 
Oh, I'm out a second. Okay. Yo, I, I'm going to skip the base running. I can't do it. I'm terrible. <laughs> I can only hit. And apparently not even well. So, yeah, we got to figure it out. I feel like every time I get on the bases, I'm out. It's not good. Yeah, keep throwing over. This is fun. There we go. Perfect, perfect. Get out, ball. Get out. Stretch. It is out of here. I accidentally hit the middle button. Ben Bones, two-run bomb. Keep throwing over. He's going to score anyway because Ben Bones goes yard. Runners on first and third. Two down. Need a hit. And he throws very, very slowly. Turning on a fastball, we're going to have to wait and wait and wait for it to finally get here. Well, let's see. I mean, I got on top of it. Not good. Ben Bones out at first. Didn't take advantage of that opportunity. I don't really like facing lefties, though. I just don't. And here's another one. Tyler Irwin this time. But Ben Bones, two for three. I'd love to rip one. And that one is going to be ripped. Late, but a base knock. That one shoots in a right field past the second baseman. And uh, let's see if I can finally figure out how to run the bases. Probably not. Will I run automatically? Yes. Okay. As long as I'm not making outs myself, we're going to be good. Way to take him out at two. That's good baseball. Play to injure him. Chase Utley style. Gotta love that. <laughs> Our cap is increasing, though. Gotta love that. We're up to a 51 overall. Starting here, what's going on? Is this the next game in the series? Suddenly, it's top one. Now, this is the next game in the series. I guess we're playing a series out? Just going right to the next game? I don't know how that works. I'm new to the road to, to, road to the show. Give me, you know, cut me some slack. Give me a break. And I swear, they only have lefties. They only have lefties. Come on, Ben. Get on one. This pitcher can't find the plate. I don't blame him. I would be scared, too, if I was pitching to Ben Bones. Knowing that the next Bo Jackson could take you deep at any moment. And it should have been that moment. Just took a strike. Minus vision for taking a strike. I'm just staying patient. Good squared up. That is the third good squared up line out of the video. Let's keep track. That's always fun. When I do everything correctly and I'm not rewarded. Love that. Maybe it's only they take a strike uh, if it gets to two strikes. And you get minus vision. I don't really know. Because that was a strike that I took. And uh, didn't give me anything bad. And that one is a, guess what? Good squared up line out. That's four. <laughs> Fantastic. I'm having a great time. That's my favorite thing. Is when you do everything perfectly correctly. But hey, that's baseball. Ugh. Do everything correct and don't get rewarded. That's, uh, I'm a little bit off to it. Good, good line out. <laughs> I'm about to lose my mind. Do you understand? I've never lined out more. And that's a terrible swing. I'm getting frustrated. That's a frustrated swing. We're getting massacred. It's 11 to 2. And every single time I get on the ball with good timing, it's a line out. Like you're killing me. Oh, play next game is what I'm clicking. Okay. I like that. That's not too bad. Dynamic challenge. Drive and a run. Press and hold X to select your challenge. I mean, it's happening. One out. I'm going to good squared up line out to center field and hopefully we can get a sack fly. Stop throwing over. I beg you. Let me hit. And that one swung on and belted. Get boned. It's a no doubter. Oh my goodness, absolutely crushed. Can we get a replay on that one? That thing was onto the concourse. Fastball looked like middle in, and Ben Bones didn't miss it. Unbelievable. Can we get a distance on that or an exit velo? 110 off the bat, 449 feet. Looking like Luis Robert launching a home run in the minors. Ronald Acuna going yard. Some of these big righty young power hitters. Gotta love it. That thing was a nuke. And Ben Bones got hit. 
Charge the mound. Can I do that? Charge the mound, man. I want to fight the pitcher badly. That one's hit on the ground. That is a diving stop by the third baseman, but it looks like he can't recover and get that throw over to third base or first base. So runners on third, second, first. Base is juiced, one out. Here's Kenny Zemecki up at the plate. And he takes a ball four. He's going to walk. Ben Bones advances to third. Here's the 3 0. Reed Love would love to find the strike zone, and he just can't. And that's ball four. Ben Bones is going to score. Top four. We're up nine to one. Runner on third. Only one out. Reed Love has only gotten one out. Things are not about to get better with Ben Bones up at the plate. Runner on third. This is almost guaranteed to be 10 1 here in a minute. And that is exactly what happens. That is deep to center. And that one is off the wall. Can we get three? We're going to hold it two. We're going to hold two. I'm back picked because I, I don't get how it works. Ah! Whatever. <laughs> We're up 13 to one. Pull in a single away from the cycle. That is noteworthy. And that is a rollover. Good change. Good change up. That got me way out in front. Top of the seventh, it is 16 to 2. Seawolves. This one's probably game over. And that is a pitch I can mash. Honestly, like most of the time when I come up hitting, I'm just looking for something, you know, in. Preferably something hard, you know. Like that fastball. I'm usually just praying to turn on one and, and mash it. So that away fastball can get me uh, looking a lot. But with 0 2, we're definitely going to be swinging at it. And that one is way up. Good to hold back, I guess, with the check swing. He's only throwing heaters. They're not coming in that hard. Let's see, hopefully we can get on one. Good sinker away. I don't really know why I took that, but it's a good take, clearly. Here's the 2-2. And that one is a good sinker. Thought it was going to have a lot more drop than it did. Uh, it just didn't break that much. And we pop out. I need to I need to just get on one. Finally up against a righty. I just prefer hitting against a righty. Righty, righty. Couldn't stay back on that though. It is 20 to 3. This is a football blowout. Oh my goodness, what is happening here? And that one is ripped into the gap. That could be the triple. I'm getting three. Hopefully we're trying to score. He's going home. Get three, Ben. Get three. Here's a throw, and he is safe. Oh, my goodness. A single away from the cycle with Ben Bones. Will he hit again? That's the question. I don't know. Ball hit on the ground. Nope. It's a line out, and I'm out. <laughs> it's unreal how bad I am at running the bases. Unreal. But we ended up a single away from the cycle. We got the toughest part. A triple. We got the homer. We had a double. Five ribbies. And uh, unfortunately, just uh, could not quite get that single. Probably if I'm not an idiot on the base path, we don't give up some of those uh, those easy outs. Might get another opportunity to come up. I mean, we, we got up almost every single inning. And uh, I'm sure we won whatever that challenge was against that idiot that was trying to talk trash. What an absolute clown. Perks here? I didn't really read any of that, but... We're just gonna activate him, I guess. Why not, you know? Close to tier three. So we get, um... Lightning reflexes are off the radar. I'm not really gonna be swinging at balls, so... Um... I guess lightning reflexes? I don't know. I don't know about that. Once again, beating heart, and um, why not do, let's do defibrillator. All right, so those are the perks that we're going to be rocking at the moment. And um, I guess it's going to do it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy. Yeah.